My channel my name is Joanna and today I'm coming to you with a video about casual perfumes for women. The idea come from the comment I got under one of my last videos so thank you very much for this idea it's brilliant. If you want to see my selection of perfumes that are perfect for casual wear please don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe and stay with me. I will start from the perfume I am obsessed with. It's perfect for everyday wear, it's inoffensive and it's Chloe EDP. This is only by Goody, but I'm obsessed with this one because it covers so many occasions. It's perfect for a wedding, it's perfect for everyday wear, for the office, everybody seems to like it. It's so inoffensive, it smells like a luxury rosy hand soap. It also seems to be a pretty good dupe for Delina La Rose, so if you don't want to spend that much money on a Delina, please take a look at this one because it is almost identical. Of course there are many people that will say that Delina La Rose does it better but for me this one covers all of the needs without spending money on the very expensive parfums de Marly. And I got many comments under the video where I was talking about this perfume that it is really a good dupe for Delina La Rose so it's not only me there are many people that says the same. So if you have never heard about this one because it is possible it has been released in 2008 so ages ago and I know that there are many of us that are interested in new releases we are bombarded with every season but please don't forget about this one because it's still available it still waits for you in the stores so if you don't want to spend money on the Lina Rosé please take a look at this one it's so inoffensive it smells roses as I said previously like a luxury rose water or a rosy hand soap for me it's an ultimate luxury scent and if I will get married one day I think that this will be my signature scent for a wedding. This one is so inoffensive that probably people will think that you just took a shower and you're not wearing perfume at all. This is how delicate and subtle this one is. So this is a very good position from Chloe. If you have never smelled this one what are you waiting for? This has been an inspiration for so many new perfumes but still I am coming back to this one every time. And right now I bought only 30 ml but I regret a bit so when I'm finished with this one I will just run to the store and buy a huge bottle. And there is also a plus with buying a perfumes that are not hyped anymore. They are not as expensive so if you wanted the Lina La Rose but you didn't want to spend money and if you're looking for something similar please take a look at this one. You will not regret your decision because maybe this is the scent you will fall in love with as I did. Top notes of the Chloe DP are Peony, Litchi, Freesia, Middle Notes, Rose, Lily of the Valley, Magnolia and Base Note, Virginia Cedar and Amber. It opens a bit sharp because of the Litchi but it disappears pretty quickly and then you get this beautiful rose that will follow you throughout the day. The longevity is amazing, it will last all day on your skin and on your clothes and silage is moderate and it will lead this subtle trail of roses. So if you are looking for a perfect scent for work or meet up with your girlfriends, don't look any further because Chloe EDP might be your girl. The next proposition is from Narcisa Rodriguez and I was pretty doubtful if I should talk about it on my channel because I have only a sample of it but I think it's a very good scent for someone who's looking for something to wear to work or maybe on an everyday basis. This is an inoffensive floral scent, not groundbreaking but also Maybe it's something you're looking for. It's Narciso All of Me and this is the newest release from Narciso Rodriguez. I was trying to look up of non the reviews on Fragrantica but there are not many and people seem to love it or hate it. It's a very polarizing scent. I was wearing it today during the day and I need to admit that the silage and longevity are very intimate. It will not leave a trail and not everybody seems to notice that I was wearing a perfume. I didn't get any compliments but it doesn't mean you won't. Maybe it's just something with my skin because it is a very pretty floral scent. Maybe this is something that one of you is looking for because not everybody can wear a perfume that leaves a huge trail. Some of you work in an environment where people can get very sensitive, for example in the healthcare. So maybe Narcissa Rodriguez All of Me can be a position for you. Main accords are rose, floral, musky, powdery, woody, fresh, spicy, aromatic, warm, spicy, citrus and herbal. And this is one of those 
cozy, nice, inoffensive scents that you can wear on an everyday basis, running errands and especially for example for work. When you're not trying to offend anyone, when you're trying to smell nice but not leave a huge trail. I work in an office so this perfume seems to be a perfect position for me when I'm not trying to offend anyone but I still want to smell clean and cozy and I can smell myself maybe not the whole day but for some time at least and if you're working in an environment where people are sensitive to perfumes for example in a healthcare this one can also be a great position for you the top note of Narcisse All of Me is Magnolia the middle notes Rose and Bourbon Geranium and base note Musk and Sandalwood if I should describe this one it's just a beautiful floral scent with a very moderate longevity and silage perfect for someone who doesn't want to offend anyone at work but still want to smell rosy flowery and just pleasant i would say that it will be also perfect during the spring when the nature is coming back to life please let me know in the comments down below what do you think about the newest release from narciso rodriguez maybe you're a fan maybe it is a pass for you i don't think i will be buying a full bottle when i'm done with this sample but we all have different tastes this is why there are so many perfumes on the market if something doesn't work for me it doesn't mean that it won't work for you so if you're looking for a perfume with intimate silage and modern longevity maybe Narcisa Rodriguez all of me will be a perfect fragrance for you the next perfume is also worth mentioning I was talking about it on my channel already but this is a perfect position for everybody working in and healthcare or just looking for a perfume for everyday basis inoffensive pretty sweet cozy perfume and this is clean reserve skin it smells like salty praline it's one of my favorite perfume and you can see it by the dent i'm using it all the time i'm working in an office so it's very important for me not to offend my colleagues and it is not everyone that loves heavy perfumes on women so this is why this is a perfect position it smells like salty praline so inoffensive so beautiful it smells like you're eating pralines on the beach by the sea and I know it's a very weird description, but I cannot find anything better to describe this scent. It is just perfect, inoffensive, very sweet, very cozy scent everybody seems to love. And all of my colleagues compliment it every time I wear it. So even though it is quite intimate scent, I'm overspraying it a bit all the time. So everybody can smell me and everybody says that I smell like heaven. So compliments are coming from the left and right when I'm wearing this perfume. Perfume. so if you're looking for something inoffensive sweet smelling like a praline it's that people love and compliment all the time please look at the clean reserve skin i bought a hundred ml bottle because i'm going through it like crazy i'm over spraying it and i'm not afraid to admit it this is a beautiful sweet floral musky perfume but you cannot smell musk as much as praline sweet salt and it is a very weird combination but it works this perfume smells like your skin but better if you're working in a healthcare or in an environment that people can be sensitive to a perfume please take a look at this one because this is heaven it leaves a subtle trail of pralines behind you so people on a diet will definitely hate you but you will smell very pleasant this scent is really worth trying and having in your collection i know that when i'm done with this 100 ml bottle i will definitely buy it again because this is my go-to scent every time i want to smell inoffensive beautiful sweet with a hint of musk this is my go-to fragrance this is my baby and also if you want to start your adventure with masks i think it's a perfect position for you because even though it is a floral musky scent you cannot smell this heavy animalic mask in this one this is a very soft a very likable mask that will make you fall in love with masks perfumes please let me know if you tried clean reserve skin and what you think about this fragrance i'm very curious to know next one i have a perfume i fell in love recently and i needed to have it in my collection as i mentioned hundred times already I work in an office so I also need a perfumes that I can wear to the office that everybody can tolerate so this one was a perfect position to wear to work and I'm talking about Chloe Nomad and now this is not an absolute version I also was thinking about this one but I was looking for some reviews on the internet especially on YouTube and I was comparing them in the store and it seems that only opening is different in those two and the dry down is exactly the same and the absolute 
Absolu has this very weird opening that reminded me of a wet soil so it wasn't as pleasant for me as I was expecting this is why I chose this one plus I also need to admit the longevity on the Chloe EDP the original version was better on my skin. As I mentioned previously the dry down was exactly the same on my skin so I didn't think any longer and I went for an original Chloe Nomad. Main accords on Nomad are woody, citrus, fruity, mossy, earthy, floral, sweet, powdery, warm, spicy and patchouli. And this is exactly this. This is a beautiful woody scent that is perfect for everyday occasions. This is also perfect for going out with your girlfriends or just meeting with your family. This one is very inoffensive and it gets so many compliments that you will not believe. Everybody asks me what I'm wearing when I'm wearing Chloe Nomad. And this is also kind of a weird proposition from Chloe because I was always associating Chloe with all of those perfumes that are very elegant, fancy, and this one seems to be very woody, adventurous, and this is a perfect scent you can wear to leather boots and jeans and leather purse. This is how I imagine myself wearing this perfume. Top notes are Chloe Nomad are Mirabel, Bergamot, Lemon, Orange, Middle Notes, Freesia, Peach, Jasmine and Rose and Base Note, Oak Moss, Patchouli, Amberwood, White Mask and Sandalwood. I have never imagined a perfume smelling of all of those citruses and Mirabel smelling so pleasantly and so inoffensive like Chloe Nomad. And if you saw some of my other videos you know that I hate Jasmine in a perfume but when it's blended and it's in the background like in Chloe Nomad it doesn't bother me at all. It's very well blended and in the background and in Chloe Nomad Jasmine is almost impossible to detect for me. So it's a plus. For me this perfume is a perfect blending of fruits, citruses and mirabel and all of those flowers like freesia, jasmine and rose. And I love rose in the perfumes and I love fruity openings in the perfumes and I love when those fruits are very well blended with flowers. And I love wearing it on everyday basis to work, running errands, meeting with girlfriends, meeting with family, dinner with my grandma. It covers all of the needs. And I also need to admit that it is a head turner. It gets complimented all the time. It leaves a trail, but a very pleasant one, very inoffensive one, soft, cozy, woody, perfect for autumn. I also need to admit that the longevity and silage are insane. So I can smell myself the whole day wearing this perfume. It turns heads and I get complimented every time I'm wearing this. Everybody seems to notice that I'm wearing a very pleasant inoffensive perfume and they are asking what it is that smells that good. So if you're looking for a perfume that you can wear on everyday basis, running errands, eating dinner with your grandma, don't look any further because Chloe Nomad is what you were praying for. I can totally recommend this one. It very quickly became one of my favorite perfumes and I really hope that it will be your favorite as well. And the next perfume I wanted to mention is a very pretty, likable, everyday scent and this is Twilly by Hermes. It has a ginger, bitter orange and bergamot in the opening so this is a spicy, fruity, floral perfume. Perfect for everyday, non-offensive, very likable, very pleasant, perfect for autumn and winter. There are also white florals in middle notes like tuberose, orange blossom and jasmine and thankfully jasmine is not a main note, it's very much in the background which makes this perfume very likable for me. If you love jasmine, if you like white florals, if you like spicy, sophisticated, very inoffensive, very pleasant and likable perfume, please take a look at Twilly. Really. It has so many fans and in one of my latest video I was also comparing it to its flanker Poivre which is a peppery take on an original Twilly and it also seems to have many fans and I wasn't impressed by this one. This is why I chose the original Twilly EDP for this video. So if you're looking for something that is inoffensive and you can safely wear to work, take a look at an original Twilly. This fragrance seems to have so many fans and I totally get it. It seems that it's perfect for every season, perfect for spring and summer, but also for autumn and winter because of the ginger in top notes. The silage and longevity are moderate, which makes it perfect for everyday basis, for school, work, everywhere you need to smell inoffensive, Twilly got you back. 
It reminds me of a scent of a luxury body lotion or a soap. It smells like your skin but better, like you just took a shower and went straight to work. I cannot imagine myself one person who could be offended by this scent, so if you're looking for a scent that will please everyone, it really got you covered. It opens fresh and spicy because of a ginger, bergamot and bitter orange in the opening and then you get all of the white florals like freesia, jasmine and orange blossom. On the base note we have sandalwood and vanilla which makes it a very cozy scent in the dry down. So if you're looking for a perfume that smells spicy, fresh, clean and cozy at the same time, you can go to work, running errands, to the hospital, nobody will be offended by this one. And judging by the comments under my last video where I was talking about this one, it has so many fans. We cannot all be rogue, right? So if you want a perfume that you can wear on every possible season and occasion, please get yourself a Twilly by Hermes. You will not regret this one. Even though the silage and longevity on the skin are not that great, it lasts ages on the clothes. So if you want to smell like a fresh laundry, like a luxury soap or body lotion, Twilly by Hermes is your best bet. Please let me know what do you think about all of the perfumes I was talking about today. If you're a fan of one of them i would like to know if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do because i have more content coming if you have any questions or if you have videos ideas for me please leave them in the comments down below and i will see you in my next video bye